Welcome to Inside Out Boards with your host, Cody Bass. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Big hello to all you new subscribers. I want to thank you for subscribing. I hope everybody had a good and safe Halloween and that them little goblins didn't come a gobbling up all your candies. So, um, here we are and right now outside it's blowing about 30 knots the temperature's about 20 um, it's cold but we're gonna get back on this little cutie of a Johnson uh, 15 what I just did was I zipped off What's that? Oh. <laughs> we just lost power like I said it's windy out um, wouldn't surprise me if we don't lose it again so if everything goes dark the power went out so um like I said we're gonna get back on this little 15 Johnson it's a Cody Cody I just took out the three bolts that hold the thermostat cover on we're gonna pop that off and see what that old thermostat and so forth looks like so let's get to doing it let me get a little tap it hammer a little tap of time Gotta move you around. Gotta load you down. Get you in there. That's about good, I think. Get you a little closer over here. Over here. Oh. Not too awfully bad there. Eh, let's see what the old statum looks like. And, oh, looky there. It just fell right apart. So, let me get you on pick. Oh, yeah. Gotta gently pry this thing out of there. Gently, gently! It seems to be sticking on this side a little bit. Well, let's try some needle nose. I don't want to hurt, destroy more than. It's pretty yucky. But I was able to save the grommet part and everything. Yeah, I don't know that that thing was working. And it's got a bunch of yuck inside it. Do, 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 do. So what I'm going to do, I think, is I'm going to put this thing back on there and run it a little bit without the thermostat. Get nothing else to flush all this crap out of there. Yeah. 
So, first thing I'm going to do is try and start it without the cover on and see what kind of water I'm getting pushing out of there. So, let me get her in the tank. And as you can see, I got the complete thermostat cover and everything off. And I just want to see what kind of water that water pump's moving up through there. Then I'll put that back on. Get her pumped up. And let me get a door cracked here so I don't suffocate myself. here for a minute I'll start it then move you back over there better move you a little further let's see what we get okay mm -hmm. pull out that choke Pull that back out and put that cover back on. See what kind of temperature. this little cover back on then I'm gonna run this thing and we're gonna see what kind of temperatures we get without that thermostat in there. And that'll let me know which direction I should go. She's steaming and all that again.
dug a hole. That's at the top spark plug hole. So there's what's left of the thermostat. It's just a piece of junk, the pop it and all. It's uh I'll have to look and see if I got one. I don't think I do. Um, but all that heat that I had going down here in the leg and everything is completely gone. That thing's nice and cool. It's just barely lukewarm. Without the thermostat in it, no matter where I checked on it, I couldn't get it. Um, hardly to get at 100 degrees. I found one spot at the top spark plug, right at the plug, it went to 102. Um, so it needs a thermostat. I think the grommets are probably fine in this thing. And so I'll either look at my stuff, see if I have a thermostat, or I'll have to order one. But uh, I think that's all we got going with this little guy. It's the old thermostat. Several of you weighed in and said, hey, 
It's the thermostat. And, uh, yeah, I, I mean, I, that was going to be part of the, the overall facts check on it anyway. Was, that's the first thing, especially on this model, because it's just three little bitty 3 8 inch bolts. You just zip them off with the impact and check it out. But, yeah, had her blocked up, so the water was just coming up there, kind of heating up all around the bottom of the block there, and then just falling right back down, I guess. So, but... I'll probably run her again tomorrow. It's supposed to warm up a little bit tomorrow. And uh, I'll run her for a good 10, 15 minutes without the stat. And then I'll go out and see if I have one. Put it all back together. And run her and see how she does. But I think that's all it's going to be. Nice little motor. I rebuilt this motor um, four or five years ago. I rebuilt. I did a complete rebuild on it. Um, I did this one. And then I did a, an Evinrude one. No, it wasn't. It was a Johnson as well. I did two of these. The one Johnson had an Evinrude cover on it. That's what it was. But it was a Johnson as well. Two of these identical to them. So I rebuilt this one four or five years ago. And uh, still running good. And luckily, as soon as it started, he noticed that heat. He saw the steam and everything and brought it to me right away. So hopefully it's just, you know, taste that. You understand. Right. I went and got a new thermostat out of there, and I'm just going to clean this out in there. Okay, so you got a little spring that goes like so. Then you come in from the back side, like I said, you want this nylon to be facing outward for the big spring to press up against that nylon. Put in your T-stat like so. That all goes in there. Like so. And that's the way it should look in there. There you go. That's the way it should look. And then the big spring and cap go on top. Right in there up against that. There you go. That goes right around the seal. Almost forgot it. And we're going to put it in the tank, give it a testimus run. And see, don't she cool normal. So, let's get her in the tank. Start it up and see if we got this problem taken care of. It's name that doom For your own confusion, we're on guard this time against your final solution. Oh no! For your own confusion, we're on guard this time against your final solution. Oh no! Name that tune. Mm.
now let's get her up out of that tank and fill that leg. Remember that water coming out of that lower leg. Impertent. Impertent, man. All right. Now, let me touch this lower leg at the water pump nice and cool as can be. At the exhaust leg, a little bit of warmth, but what you should expect. Nothing like it was doing. That's the leg, right above the water pump. And that's the midsection leg at the exhaust part of the leg up, up in here. So, right around that water pump. That's what you want to see. Fred got on his winter cap. He says even for a porch weather frog, it's getting pretty chilly. He been complaining. He thanked me for that motor that had all the flies in it, though. He said he gained 10 pounds. Oh, Fred, never happy. Fred, the miserable one-eyed pissed off weather frog say bye Fred so we got that little uh, 15 Johnson squared away turned out to be just a thermostat so the fella got lucky um, it's running nice and cool as the old cucumber so we got that one squared away I can call him up do him up a bill and say come get it you made out so it's a good little motor real clean it's a 2003 little two-stroker fine little motor so we got that all taken care of and so now I gotta decide what next I'm gonna bring in here and trust me I got a lot of them that I can bring in here you understand and that's gonna be a wrap on this one I want to thank you for watching that's one more hack from Cody hack. now make sure you subscribe to inside out boys with your host Cody Bass